am Michaela and I'm the TerraCore member at the Westport River Watershed Alliance and I'm here to talk to you today about one of my favorite things, fall. Fall is known for its beautiful scenery, but why does fall look the way it does? Let's find out. Leaves serve as the provider of food for the entire tree. Leaves are made up of cells. In each cell, a process called photosynthesis is occurring. Photosynthesis converts sunlight, water, carbon dioxide, and other nutrients into food for the tree. An essential part of photosynthesis is chlorophyll, which has pigments in it to absorb the light, and throughout most of the year, it is predominantly green. But along with the green, there's orange and yellow pigments underneath. Then the seasons change. There's less sunlight, cooler temperatures, and the leaves are no longer able to make the food for the tree the same way. They must change. Since the tree is not creating more chlorophyll and it is no longer in use, it begins to break down the strong green pigment, leaving behind the remaining color. This is what gives us the beautiful fall foliage for some of our trees. This is how orange and yellow fall foliage comes to be. Other well-known fall colors are red and brown. The red pigment in leaves is actually produced while the chlorophyll is disappearing, unlike orange and yellow, which is always present. Brown fall foliage just shows leaf senescence, or leaf death. All these factors come together and provide us with the fall we know and love. Thanks for joining us today. Hope you enjoyed our video. For more of our content, you can go to westportwatershed.org, and I'll see you next time.